know, you you been one of them dishonored, man. All right, but he does have that balance, though. The Lord did create that balance. many other prophecies they're going to be on the bottom so hey, that, that's why the, the scriptures comfort us because yeah when we first when we first got to this thing yeah you get mad at you so you look at them goddamn devil man. but then you see their end and it comforts you it's less stressful in your brain and that's exactly what's going on in the scripture it was less stressful oh okay this is what's going to happen to them so we're going to get into it, it says surely thou didn't set them in slippery places <laughs> Yeah, he set them in slippery places, man. He, he set them up. He set them up to um, to do the things that they're doing, so they can fall into a ditch. Okay, the same the same devices that they're setting up, the same laws that they're coming back coming out with, all they're gonna fall. That's a, a trap that they're falling into, man. All right, it's gonna backfire. The new world order. The new world order. All right, that's not gonna happen. It says when they're about to fill their belly, the Most High is going to rain his wrath upon their head. All right? So, hey, set them in slippery places. Now, casteth them down into destruction. How are they brought into desolation as in a moment? They are utterly consumed with terrors. <clears throat> so, and it said utterly in a moment, just like at the snap of a finger, man. All right? So... As, as things, because that's how it's gonna be. Things gonna be going on good, and then it's gonna complete 180, man. Complete 180. Into the into the world is gonna be a surprise. You know, I say the world, those that that choose not to acknowledge the truth for whatever reason. All right, we have the prophecies that are coming to pass, but we know that it, it's, it's gonna be. That's that's that thief in the night. Okay, suddenly in a moment. All right, the most he is going to come at a time that we we're not aware of. All right, but we're going to have at least a, some knowledge of the times, man. Because we're watching the prophecies, we're in the scriptures. But to the outsiders, to those that are without, it's going to be real quick, and you're going to be surprised at how things are happening. You're going to be scared how things are happening. You said like a woman in travail. You know, when that baby's about to come, you can't stop it. Yeah. But what? Uh, at a moment, as soon as that that baby got to come, the, and the labor pain started, yeah, right. you know, that's that moment, and then you can't stop it. From there. You know, rewind button, you know, stop. There's no pause. You can't, you know, do nothing. It's just gonna go forward. It's gonna end the way it's supposed to end. That, it's just not gonna return until accomplished. Um, 
and what I sent it there to do. You know, uh, roughly paraphrasing in Isaiah. All right? My word should not return unto me for it. Which means everything that the Most High sends out, his head, who shall return the, the, um, the arrow of a mighty archer? What? That's a prophecy. The arrow, the, the missiles being shot over here. You know, amongst many other things, as the brother said, these different plagues that are going to come upon America. Lord already know what he gonna do. <laughs> he gonna stop it. You know, you can create all of these different programs to fight against the prophecies, all these different uh, misinfor uh, misinformation to try to distort the prophecy. Like the fact that they added more to the EU to try to upset the prophecies. Like, no, it's still the EU. It's, you know what I'm saying? It still goes back to the same uh, uh, Homeless, man. It says, uh, it says, uh, Psalm 73 and 19. How are they brought into desolation as in a moment they are utterly consumed with terrors? As a dream when one awakens, it, it, it's going to be shocking because you see all this power that they have, you see how they're living. Now, how did that happen to them? They go just like in um, just like in the book of Isaiah, the fourteenth chapter. Say, how have thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer? Now, how how are you how are you become as weak as me? All these different scriptures that, that people are going to be surprised at the destruction of, of, of these Edomites because of how much power they have now, man. And then they're gonna they're really gonna be shocked when they see you know men like us that are like around four corners of the earth. That are getting shipped, uh, beamed up on the, on the chariots. Like, how the hell are the most powerful people up on the earth getting killed, and the lowest of the Lord getting saved by these? What, what's going on? But this is what the scripture's been telling us, man. As, as a dream of one awaken, so, O oh Lord, when thou awakest, thou shalt despise their image. Thus my heart was grieved, and I was pricked in my reins. So foolish was I, and ignorant, I was as a beast before yeah, you say I was ignorant. Why? Because he didn't know that he wasn't supposed to be that way until he saw their end. And once he had gained that knowledge of their end, he said, oh, okay, I feel better now. These people are going to be destroyed. That's how we feel, man. We, we don't... We don't trip about being on the bottom because the Most High chose us. He chose us. He gave us the ultimate power to do this work. We couldn't do this on our own. He didn't give this to no other nation. Yeah, we don't do it. Nobody can. Yeah, but if, if no, yeah, if no, other, no other nation outside us is going to be able to do this, man. So foolish was I and ignorant, I was as a beast before thee. Nevertheless, I am continually with thee. Thou hast holden me by my right hand. Thou shalt guide me with, uh, with thy counsel, and, and afterward receive me to glory. Whom have I in heaven but thee? <laughs> and there is none upon earth that I desire besides thee. So it's like, who else do I got? Like, I don't got nothing here, and you, you, you the only person in heaven that I got that I can go to that can help me, you know? Like I said, guide me with thy counsel because he knew he, he can trust him. My flesh and my heart fell it, but the most high is the strength of my heart and my portion forever. For lo, they that are far from thee shall perish. Thou hast destroyed all those that are far from thee. Did not the scripture say that the wicked, their heart is far from the Lord? Their, their mouth speaketh against the heavens? It says, uh, was it, uh, Psalm 14. It says that they don't even look for the Lord, man. Those that those are the ones that are far from the Lord, man. They shall perish. They're gonna they're gonna be put to death in some form or fashion. Okay, by way by, by way of biblical property. It says, for lo, they that are far from thee shall perish. Thou hast destroyed all them that go a whoring from thee. But it is, uh, but it is good for me to draw near to the Most High. I have put my trust in the Most High Yahweh, 
that I may declare all thy works. Yeah, what else do we have, man? That's all we have is the Most High, man. Declaring his works, the things that he's done for our people. The way he, he protected us against the nations when we were doing right. Like when we were going in the battle, when we were going to battle, well, he, we would have small numbers. Our people, our people that trusted in the Lord then that was going to war, guess what the Lord looked out for us, man? And we were going up against hundreds of thousands, man. We had a small number. We probably have, what, like 2,000 or somewhere in that area? And the Lord looked out for us, man. That's why, that's why we're supposed to have faith in the Lord, because the Lord looked out for them that, he looked for those that seek them, man. Not those that's looking for some type of earthly benefit for him to please them, man. So with that being said, we give all praise, honor, and glory to, to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Rukar Kadash. Double honors unto our apostles and our elders at Great Millstone and rule well and teach the same. And salutations unto the elect Akim that are doing this work about the four corners of the earth. We're going to say, Mawaf Lapa Ball, 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 Mawaf Lapa Ball,